Man says he is frustrated and shocked, adding that the school district refuses to tell him why he lost his job. 41 Action News reporter Josh Helmuth spoke with the man and the school to find out what happened. Josh. Yeah, guys, we did a story on Paul Jones two years ago. He made waves on social media for wearing a different tie to school 400 days in a row. He had a very special bond with a lot of people here at Wheat Ridge Middle School, but recently that bond was abruptly broken. After a decade at Wheat Ridge Middle School, the district fired Paul Jones June 6th. The only thing that's in my file is three religious write-ups. Jones says he has no idea why. I couldn't talk to nobody in the district. Our story in 2014 showcased Jones' streak of wearing a different tie to school. The quirky custodian appeared to be a favorite among the staff and students. Jones says he was nominated for being a great employee as recent as April, and that he always went above and beyond the duties of a janitor. Go and I pick up the snack pack program and do all of that kind of stuff. But when he asked for his work reviews... This one here is from the principal in 2015. Jones says there were new negative remarks. That's an added statement. It reads, Paul tends to make no. decisions well, that are not his to make. He needs to ask permission to when something is in a gray area. Jones attended Monday night school board meeting seeking an explanation, but the board said they can't speak about employees. For an employee that's been dismissed or terminated, it's kind of an open shot to come take the board knowing that we can't respond. We checked, and because Kansas is an employment at will state, the district can dismiss anyone from a job as long as it's not for discriminatory reasons. Friends believe the case against Jones doesn't add up. It felt like there may not be the right reasoning behind the dismissal or termination. And as the kind notes keep adding up. A crying night for Paul Jones. Jones has removed any hope he'll ever get his job back. After going through this whole thing, do I really want to work for somebody like that? I mean, um, I, don't th I don't think I really do. Jones says he hasn't started looking for a new job just yet, but he said he would consider taking this matter to court if it does mean clearing his name. From Gardner, Josh Helmuth, 41 Action News.